<coughs> Howdy friends, it's Friday 16th of October 2020, I'm here, centre of Taunton, and this is the memorial to the fallen in memory of the officers, non-commissioned officers, buglers and private soldiers of the 2nd Battalion, the 13th, the Prince Albert's Somersetshire Light Infantry, who laid down their lives for Queen and Country in the Third Burmese War. Now, I come here quite a lot just to really people that lay down their lives in pursuit of peace got my little Gideons here not word for word the same as the KJV I'll just pick this one out this is Timothy 2nd Timothy 4 Back 2 Timothy 3. I was going to read from 10, but I will read from the beginning. Godliness in the last days. But mark this there will be terrible times in the last days. People will be lovers of themselves, lovers of money boastful, proud, abusive, disobedient to their parents, ungrateful, unholy, without love, unforgiving, slanderous, without self-control, brutal, not lovers of the good, treacherous, rash, conceited, lovers of pleasure rather than lovers of God, having a form of godliness but denying its power have nothing to do with them. They are the kind who worm their way into homes and gain control over weak-willed women, who are loaded down with sin and are swayed by all kinds of evil desires. Always learning, but never able to acknowledge the truth. Just as Janus and Jambres opposed Moses, so also these men oppose the truth. Men of depraved minds, who as far as the faith is concerned are rejected. But they will not get very far, because, as in the case of those men, their folly will be clear to everyone. Paul's charge to Timothy. You, however, know all about my teaching, my way of life, my purpose, Faith, patience, love, endurance, persecutions, sufferings. What kinds of things happened to me in Antioch, Iconium and Lystra? The persecutions I endured, yet the Lord rescued me from all of them. In fact, everyone who wants to live a godly life in Christ Jesus will be persecuted, while evil men and impostors will go from bad to worse deceiving and being deceived. But as for you, continue in what you have learned and have become convinced of, because you know those from whom you learned it, and how from infancy you have known the Holy Scriptures, which are able to make you wise for salvation through faith in Jesus Christ. All Scripture is God-breathed and is useful for teaching, rebuking, correcting, and training in righteousness, so that the man of God may be thoroughly equipped for every good work. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Now the church is open down there. St. 
St. Mary's. Doorway. So I will be heading down there. I'll see you inside. Monday, back the 15th. Guess we call that the Tang Clock. Sperma, Sperma Cross. Try and get this in the daylight one day before it gets ripped down. Burma 1885, 86, and 87. All these people, it's their lives for the bankers. Bend them us. And this is what they fought for. The Bill Gates agenda. There's nobody about. At all. The nearest person to me is about half a mile. It's a joke. Joe. I'm down, I think that's Bridge Street or Bridge Road. It's a joke, what they've done. got it, I haven't got it. I don't know what all the fuss is about. I don't watch the television. Don't have a television. Like, like a lot of people nowadays. I refuse to pay the BBC license. Mainly because of Peter Billion. The bull, bull crap news they're giving out. Fair, fair porn. Look at that. So the detour, there's nobody about. The detour, the traffic is increasing what is commonly known as global swarming. Get out on their skates. Obviously he doesn't watch television either. Joe, what they've done. Joe, literally. Make the space. It's a joke. 
there's a, there's a multitude of reasons why they shut the road down. Firstly, it's to get rid of small businesses, make people dependent on government. The ambulance just had to go around then. We've got the old snake. Been on cobbled roads. It's a nightmare. That's, I guess you blame the government for that. Not sure what that is out there. I think that's the Lloyd Bank. Anything nefarious on that? Get that in the daylight. Yeah, so they're shutting the road down, they want to shut, this is uh, the road with no name. It's got a nice picture of the church in the sunlight. Just there. So anyway, this is in St. Mary's then. I'll just do a quick one in here. Quite a fine building. I'm not going to dwell too much in here. I'm not allowed to go beyond line I'd like to go up there I don't need to really but, um, it would be quite nice for people to have the free freedom to walk around and absorb what God energy is in here and whatever they choose. The scratch camera. So it's difficult to know where to begin doing a tour. Persecution of Christians is quite apparent. It's quite apparent. And it's, um, it's also quite and crucial, really, that people appreciate now the written word. Beautiful Lord. 